where dreams come true. Wow. Welcome to New York. A place where you can make magically cool movies, like Enchanted or whatever. Except this one. Oh, wow. I bet you never saw that coming, did you? Yawn. Is this a myth? It is not a myth. Must these dubs always criticize the movie they're dubbing off of? Sort of. Maybe. Is this an illusion? Yeah. It's not an illusion. I bet you never knew how we did this. Oh, look how impressive the computer does all the is work. Is this now. my imagination? It is not your imagination. Couldn't resist. Ah! Not the beast! Ah! Oh, wait, these are bugs. You're okay. Yeah, not beasts. Uh, Kamehameha! Oh. Nah, just kidding. If it was a real Kamehameha, Nicholas, I would your, kill your hair looks weird! Uh, so hey guys, I'm a sorcerer now. Yeah, right. Yeah, I guess it's kind of hard to believe what I am because I look and act the same in pretty much every movie I'm in. Look at that metal bird. Look at look at Jerry Bruckheimer. I mean, you would sell out. I mean, he's a really respectable man to pirate sequels who totally made more sense than the first. Well, Couple that was the director John Turtletop. I love that guy. She made cliche, I mean, groundbreaking of National Treasure One and Two. And now you're being sucked into a world of fantasy and wondrous whimsy. I mean, who can you not resist watching this film? It totally looks awesome, and I has me in it. We look stupid, though. Oh, shut up, okay? So I wasn't cast as Gandalf, but I was too awesome for it. Yeah. Sorcerers, they took that title from Fantasia, man. I hope the next one's called Rite of Spring. And just like Prince of Persia, this is gonna be a mega smash original movie. How much effort did it take you guys to think up this movie anyway? That's nothing compared to the $500 million budget we're blowing on it. I mean, spending properly. Maybe they can hire some actual film, like, I mean, uh, they don't need any actual filmmakers, which is good.